Hello everybody and it's time for another barn vlog. I'm at the barn right now and I'm standing here considering whether or not I should find out who's feeding the lunch feed and call them and ask if I should feed the horses because I don't want to wait for hours and hours until Seiko finished eating. So, um, so I came out here to do the macking out and literally when I push the wiggle barrow into the paddock, Fred goes to poop. <laughs> He's like demonstrating that he um, is making me do all the work or uh, maybe it's like marking up his territory, I don't know. <laughs> it's not gonna work. No, it's not gonna work. Yeah. He's like, I'm gonna go eat. Look, he's gonna chase Seagull. You're such a mean little brother. Yeah, he doesn't chase him really well, far though. It's just like, move over. This is my space at the feed box. Oh, yeah. They got their hyena box, so. Nom 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 nom. Nom 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 nom. Eating. It's freezing cold today. No, it's not freezing cold. I get so annoyed when people say that and it's not actually freezing temperatures. But it's really cold and windy. So yeah. It was really windy and Seiko wasn't very focused. Um, sometimes it would come a gust of wind and the leaves would scatter over the arena and he would just blank out. He wouldn't listen to me. Um, but what I'm doing is I'm just um, trying to get a, uh, control of his shoulders because he has a tendency to I wouldn't say wiggle, but like his I, his shoulders just slip away from me, and um, when they do that, he gets falls out of the contact and things. So yeah, and I set up the camera a bit stupid uh, to do this day, but basically yeah. Okay, so I'm doing some shouldering, or we're trying to do some shouldering, and. Um, He's not very, um, yeah, if you can see the camera moving, it's because the wiggle of the wind, so yeah. Uh, but yeah, he wasn't, he's, he's not very good at children's because he hasn't done them a lot. I don't know if he's done them at all. Um, so he's not, like, bending properly, he's very straight in his body, so it's more like guessing him, getting him to walk sideways in a way just to listen to my inside leg and then 
I will get him to bend properly <laughs> as he gets more supple, I guess. Um, so we are trying, I'm trying to get him to bend through his body, but it's not really working properly. And it's really hard because I don't want to like take a hold of his mouth too much, but if you don't hold on to the outer rein, he just continues into the middle of the arena. So um, what I do is to get him to move forwards when I do the shoulder ins, I trot him, I try and do good transitions, and then I do the shoulder ins after that, so that he has like trot in between each shoulder in, and I don't do the shoulder ins in trot because I can't like I can't get him to. Um, listen to my leg properly. I I suppose my leg gets weaker in trot. Um, yeah, it's something to work on. Um, but yeah, I'm working on my hands as well and they've gotten a little bit better, I think. So yeah, so I just had like to do circle and now we're doing a transition that one wasn't as good that's the previous one but and this is just more shoulder in it's just to get him warmed up but you can see he's like fighting me um uh, he doesn't really want to bend so yeah and uh what are we doing now i'm changing in rain <laughs> apparently Trotting. This must be so exciting to watch. Um, but yeah, I wish I could get somebody to film me so that it would be closer and everything. But sadly, I can't do that. Okay, so I'm trying to do the shoulder in and trot, and you can see that he falls into the middle of the arena. And yeah, he's not very cooperative, and I think this is where he. He's not moving forwards enough, so that's we got walk there. Or he wasn't supposed to walk there. He was supposed to trot. Um, so yeah. Okay, so I changed the angle. Uh, tried to put it on the other end of the school, and it's even further away. <laughs> so yeah, and I don't remember. Yeah, I'm doing. I try. I try to do like a shoulder, and this is his worst, uh, worst side to bend him. I think. I don't know. Uh, and he sometimes, when he gets tired, he's he goes into roll cure. I, I'm not doing anything. He just tucks his nose in, and even if I try to ride him forward, he just yeah doesn't want to go. And I'm just here. I'm just doing. Uh, Rising trot and just give us both a break, basically, <laughs> because I was just like, oh my god, I can't do even do a proper shoulder in. I'm so demotivated. So yeah, and then I think we're doing some cantering. Okay, so we're stopping. Why are we stopping? Oh yeah, <laughs> the cat. And there's a. Uh, no? No? Okay. I thought there was a car coming, but apparently... Maybe I cussed it out, I can't remember. So I'm trying to get him to, like, collect a little bit before I do the canter transition. And, yeah. So the left canter is the one, the best one. And it's still not very good. And uh, as you can see, he falls in a bit. And I try to ride him forwards and just at the same time push him out with my inside leg and it's really hard for him because he's not very strong so there he breaks um, the counter and I was like okay um, just have a little bit of a walk break and I'll try again so I cut, cut something there and we're trying again and he's getting a bit like tense because he gets tense from the cantering 
and so he goes into canter fairly well and I started to get him to take the outside rein a little bit and then he starts to trot and I gave him a really like push with my leg and he started bucking well small bucks but still and then he started bucking almost again and yeah he was a, got more and more tense basically and I was just like what am I gonna do with you <laughs> so I um, tried to ca calm him down a bit and with walk and yeah I'm still working on the canter thing but I trusted him I walked him and then I did some more canter in the end where I got him to do it at least for a little bit and not be a complete maniac with throwing his head in the air and stuff so yeah you can see that he's better uh, now and he just pulled me out of the saddle <laughs> there so yeah so that was all for this barn vlog and I hope you enjoyed it and if you wanna get updates on what's happening on my channel I hope you like and subscribe on comments and everything. Bye!